to um Are you so serious? <laughs> wow. Hey guys, it's Krispy Kreme C here and welcome back to a current household video and in today's current household video we are actually playing with my single dad life series so like when i say current uh household i'm saying like last played i haven't played this household in a while and and i just now started playing it this year and i started to realize how much i missed playing with them so much and i don't know what happened to his stuff Okay, it might be in our um, household inventories. I don't know. Like, it was here. It was here one minute, and it's not. Oh, it is. It's just all in here for some unknown reason. But we're going to put that back on his desk. So, I am so excited to introduce you guys to the characters because I have missed them so much. I have not. Oh, my gosh. I have not played with them in so long and I'm just now starting to play with them and it's just a miracle honestly I even remembered them it's kind of sad but like let's be real for a second <laughs> I have not played with them in so long and um I'm like trying to put his stuff somewhere and it's not working okay we're gonna stick that there um so we currently have the whole household here feeling like trash and everybody's feeling sick and all and whatnot and we even have our butler here there's so much things going on. okay uh, uh oh okay i'm like who so let me just quickly pause and show you guys uh the characters their traits and all that fun jazz so we first have a daniela let me i think i'm just gonna show you guys their family tree their family tree is all over the place i don't even know if half the people are gonna show up okay so we have what oh okay so like i said this was my single dad life like way back in like this was like before covid so probably 2018 2017 and i've been playing with them ever since and it's just like they have a whole lot of stuff going on. So this is um, Carter, I'm pretty sure. And then Faith. Um, we're just going to say that he died. They're, they both died by from old age. And they are uh, Lucas's parents. And Faith did recently die. So some people, like, if you guys see, I'll show you guys. They're kind of going through it. They're mourning. And it's like... Um, yeah, she recently died. So let's just say Carter's dad died because he had lung cancer, because he constantly was smoking and drinking, and he died because of that. And then Faith, she died pretty recently in the game. I don't know how recently. I haven't played with them in a while. But I'm just not realizing that they do still miss her a lot. They were, they're all having a hard time. And then this is actually... Um, her stepmother which lucas is married to and this was his wife before she died <laughs> death by hunger oh this is actually okay she was supposed to die because um of other reasons basically she drowned um but it says she died by hunger so i guess she died by hunger and drowning at the same time but she died. She's currently bald right now because the CC that I had on her before, I deleted from my game. So she is bald. Um, she's probably, yeah, but she's dead. And that's um, Darwin's and Daniela's mother or birth mother. And Daniela and Darwin are supposed to be twins. I don't think they're identical, but they're supposed to be twins and they are twins. And um, Lucas and Kylie had River and asher which i'll introduce you guys in a minute and then um daniela is with she's a teenager and she's it won't let me oh okay well she's not married to anyone so i guess that's why i won't show him but this is um primrose which she was recently born um and this is her dad which is also my <laughs> i'm sorry i find it funny that he already has an f in high school um 
so yeah, that's her father. That's her mother. They're both teens. Um, she's a B. F. Um, and yeah, I'm from Rose. <laughs> Jeez, I find there's nothing funny about that, but um, so she's the stepmother of them, and then that's her granddaughter. Yeah, that's her granddaughter. So that's them, and then her, she has a bit of skills. Like she has a lot of, like I said, I've been playing with them for a while, so she has a bit of skills. I'm not gonna go through them all because I don't care. She's also in high school along with um, she just recently joined the cheerleader kind of uh after school activity so she is planning on doing that but she also wants to be an inspiring actress so lucas is currently at work right now but um asher jeez i'm already getting the names mixed up okay who okay no what okay so this is the mother like i said kylie and she is actually a um singer slash kind of recorder video youtuber kind of thing um she she wants a big happy family that's her aspiration jeez they have a lot of satisfaction satisfaction points like jeez i can buy a lot of okay anyway as i was saying um she's a singer slash recorder so she does a lot of media production she's a famous singer and this whole family is pretty famous um lucas is an actor slash model i think He's an actor slash model, I think. I'm pretty sure. Um, so that's him. He's still at work right now. Everybody's sick at the moment. Darwin's Darwin wants to be a famous... What? Okay. Darwin wants to be, like, a famous writer. So he's kind of, like, the perfect son of the family. While Daniela, she's kind of the rebellious type. Like, she'll still do her homework, of course. But she is a very... Uh teenager <laughs> she's the very average teenager while um darwin wants to be like a very great artist um he also is pretty smart like i say that as if he's like not that smart but he is very smart he's a genius um i think i can okay he's a genius happy toddler and all that fun stuff he's a quick learner so yeah he's just like the perfect son that you can ever ask for and look at look at this look at this perfect oh my gosh so he is he's currently in high school but i am gonna have him go ahead and graduate early from high school because he wants to go to university which maybe we'll see him go in that in like future episodes and then daniela she's like the average typical rebellious teen um She's currently, like, gotta be in high school. She's cheerful, a goofball, indifferent to a romantic relationship. She's a happy toddler. She's a jester. And she's also innocent. Even though she doesn't... Like, she looks innocent. But, like, deep down, she's, like... She wants to be just as famous as her parents. Um, and she... Like I said, she recently recently did give birth to Primrose. So that's why she currently has, like, this little baby belly going on right now. But I'm actually gonna have her use the bathroom because she needs to... Oh. Jeez. My sims are absolutely crazy. Anyway, so let me quickly uh, show you guys the house. So this is the house. <laughs> we have, like, I didn't really do much of an intro. I also forgot the puppies. Jeez. Okay. So we have Whisper, which she's actually going to go to sleep. Whisper is our poodle. She's a poodle. I, don't, I honestly have forgotten half of our dogs, like, um, what type of breed they are. To be honest, um, I don't think it even shows their breed at the moment. So, yeah. Yeah. Um, Whisper is uh, a poodle. While Loak, I think it's Loki. Yeah, Loki is, I don't know. He, um, I have to check. I don't know what he is, honestly. A bulldog slash something something. Um, but Loki is Darwin's dog. They did get Loki specifically for Darwin. Just because Darwin was lacking in like a friend department. So they gave Loki to um, Darwin. And then Whisper's like a family dog. So Whisper is an everyone dog, not just a specific sim. But I mean, hey, she's like the, she, she prefers to be alone. And then we have River. Uh, oh, come, really? Okay. Well, then we have River, which is our youngest teen at the moment. He, I don't know, he's still trying to discover himself. He, he's lifeless, active. He's also a daredevil. Um, he's also a hero. He did recently age up, so that's why this is like that. And, um, he's, 
I have this, like, I did not cheat these up, guys. They're just, they're just this, just to be this. Like, look at him. He's just, like, I think he gets that from his, like, older brother Darwin. Like, just this perfect son on the outside. But look at him. He is so cute. Like, I love him so, so much. And then we have, um, I don't know why they constantly want to jump in the pool knowing doggone well it's cold. It's, it's literally winter right now. <laughs> what oh my gosh okay i was just gonna introduce you guys to asher i guess like okay there's so many things going on guys oh okay so i guess we're all going but there's so many things going on in this let's play mainly because i have literally not played with them in so long and i recently gave them a makeover because i was not happy with the way they originally look i had to update them to my current style and like i did start playing with them a lot off camera not too much but a lot and a lot of stuff has been happening so yeah honestly them going to prom was literally so unplanned but, like, since we're here, we might as well just, like, go. <laughs> like, she literally, she literally has a, she has no date, guys. Like, honestly, she was not even planning to come to prom. But, because, like, she did, like I said, she did recently give birth to Primrose or Prim. And it's, like, she was literally not even planning on coming to prom. So, like, she literally has no date for tonight. Um, I mean, we're going to invite him anyway, but we have like her besties. So I'm going to introduce you guys to her besties. They're actually all in a club. Um, so we're just going to quickly change to your like party wear. So, oh my gosh. Okay. <laughs> There's so many things happening right now. All right. So let's quickly change you into that. So I guess the easiest thing is to show you guys her like group. So here are like her besties, which we have Danielle, which he's like, <laughs> like I said, guys, at the time, this is their name. If you guys don't know, this is my other current series, Twisted BFFs or Twisted BFF. But, like, um, they're not loading at the moment. But, um, yeah, this was way before I even started that Let's Play, and I liked the name. So I was like, why not? So they're all teenagers. I think, yeah, he's a teen. Okay, I forgot to put him in there. Oh, well, it's fine. Um, so, so they're all teens, they all go to high school, so we have Mike, Michael, Shanae, Shanae, and then we have Alicia, I'm probably saying their names wrong, and then we have Brody, Cole, and then their little club thing going on, so they have to dance, eat, play video games, swim, and, um, be friendly to everyone, and then don't be mean to anyone, and don't fight. So they're all, like, in this club together, and they're all, like, BFFs, and they're all teens, and it's a great time. And so, um, this is actually, um, Darwin's girlfriend. I'm pretty sure they're dating. Um, if not, then I, I don't know. Like, I, I'm pretty sure they're dating at the moment. Um, if, I don't know. I'll probably check that. Oh, wow. Okay. <laughs> I mean, they should be dating, honestly, because, like, like, oh, oh, who is she voting for? But, like, no, no, seriously, they should be dating. Um, but can we, it's, it's probably too late to even ask to prom at this point. Like, can we just ask to be date, even though it's, like, kind of too late for all that? Wow. Last exception errors love ruining the vibe here love that for me i have to figure that out pretty soon because i don't want the game to crash but like um look at him he's so cute anyway i don't think it's too i think it's too late to even ask to um are you so serious <laughs> wow um why do I feel like they were dating at some point? I don't, guys. I'm being serious. Okay, resentful about no prom invitation. Are you so- I'm sorry! Okay, look. Look. We weren't even planning to come here. Okay, can you really be mad at us right now? <laughs> oh my gosh. She's, she's bitter. Okay, well- Hopefully she won't get too upset, but, like, she's currently bitter about the fact that we didn't ask her to prom. And, like, we weren't even planning to go to prom in the first place. 
So, like, can she really be mad at us right now? Oh, my gosh. I'm s Okay, look. I'm so sorry. All right, look. Can we, like, apologize? I really am sorry. But, like, they should honestly already be together. But, like I said, I have not played with them in so long, so I don't know. Um, can we vote for... Okay, we're gonna quickly vote for, like... Sure, why not? We're gonna vote for our sister because why the heck not? <laughs> oh, who should we vote? I don't know. We don't even know anyone, so like, it's like, well. Uh, we're gonna do Morgan, cause, cause why not? Uh, oh my gosh! Jeez, that scared me so bad. Oh my gosh, that was actually my timer for something else. Um, jeez, I was like, that scared me. Anyway! Um, so he's gonna quickly do those things, cause that's nice, and then probably chill out with one of her friends, I don't know, like, I mean, I feel bad cause we didn't invite her, but like, we weren't planning to even come here in the first place, and I kinda feel bad. <laughs> I'm sorry, can we like apologize? No. Can we like, maybe we can do- I forgot about- oops. Wait, oh, we're with her. Jeez. Okay, so we're going out too quickly. Um, we're going to vote her, because why not? And then we're going to vote, like, Morgan. <laughs> I feel like we're all just targeting Morgan at this point, but we're going to quickly invite um, Mike. He probably not. He probably won't even come. Curfew is about to start if you don't want to get home. Wow. Thanks. Thanks for letting us know that. Thanks. They're probably going to be out late anyway, or at least... At least... Uh, she will. Daniela will. Because she's like, I just got here, bruh. I just got here. And, like, they have yet to dance. And it's like, okay. Can we just come over here and, like... Um... I like these... Can wow. Make sure at least... what. Oh my gosh. It's playing, but, like, we can't dance to it because... Oh, wow. Wow. That is lame as heck. Okay, what we're gonna do is have him do a sweetheart's dance with her. She'll probably reject us anyway, so it's like... She's she's real... She is real bitter about us not even being able to be here. She's real... Like, she's, she's upset. Okay, so we're gonna ask him to dance with her then. Um... Jeez, he works this late? I mean, I know he works, but, like, I didn't think he worked that late. But here's Mike. Look at him. He is so handsome. <laughs> like, look at all the girls around him. Oh, my gosh. So, again, he might not even want to dance with us because, like, we didn't even invite him. Look at him. Oh. This is cute. <laughs> this is so adorable. Honestly, like, oh. Okay. Well. Wow. Okay, so let's see. You see, we're probably already getting in trouble anyway. Um, she's not feeling well at all. What is this? What is... Festering. Wow. Everybody's so bitter tonight. Let's be so for real. Come on now. All right. So... <laughs> are we like... Okay. It's not us. It's not us. But like, I don't even think he voted. Did he vote? Probably not. Look at him. He's like the shortest one here. Like, look at him. <laughs> oh my gosh. So I'm going to hopefully have him graduate early and like sign up for university. Attention everyone. We have the results for the winning. Jeez. Okay. The winners of the prom court. I am happy to announce the following winners. Prom royalty, Daniela Hendricks. Prom jester, Morgan obviously obviously congratulations please take a moment to congratulate the winners bro this is her first and probably last prom she'll ever have and like we weren't even planning to have her come we weren't even planning to have anyone come so that's why it's like yay i'm so happy look at her she's like yeah i won even without trying that she's like, can we give like a speech? I'm pretty sure we should be able to give like a little victory speech to say, hey, um, losers, <laughs> we won this one. <laughs> no, for real, like, can we give one? Like, no, I wasn't joking. Can we like, no? 
Wow. Okay, fine. Well, we won that, even though she wasn't even trying to. She honestly looks like a mother more than a teen than anything else. Um, but yay! Um, I guess for the rest of the night, we can just dance. Oops. Yeah, we're breaking her a few. It's nice. Um, we're gonna quickly slow dance, though, with their partners. I feel like they're gonna get rejected. So- Wow, she's like, I don't feel like wearing that. Um, but I guess he could come over here and talk to a couple of teens. Um, his age, like, you know, or her. She looks at- Wait! Cass ain't right! Okay, wait, 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 wait. Can we at least- Okay, this is actually one of my sims I have in, like, other thingies. But can we at least know you? Like, she is a teen, but, like, she is older. Cassie found Wayne. Wayne. Oh, they are so cute. They are so adorable. Oh my gosh. Same with them. They are so cute. Oh my gosh. Like, we're gonna probably ask her to be girlfriend later because she's probably still very bitter about us not asking her to the dance. But look at her. She is so gorgeous, guys. Oh my gosh. Okay. But we're gonna go home. Oh, guess not. Guess not. Um, use photo booth. We didn't even use photo booth. <laughs> um, okay, let's. We're gonna take a photo with um with her. I don't know. Maybe I don't know. It's almost over, and like we're probably gonna get grounded because we're not even supposed to be out this late. But hey, it is what it is. Um, did he meet her? Aww. All right. Uh, why? Okay. Well. Okay. Fine. Whatever. Whatever. Look at him in his little outfit. Okay. Let's keep the party going. Want to? Want to come to the after party? Bro, she looks twice his age, and like. No, we're like, we're pretty much losing our responsibility because we're not even supposed to be here this late. Uh, uh, okay, I think it's gonna take everything down. Oh, that's lame. I wish it, like, like, look at it an empty dance studio. It looks like a literal amp empty dance studio. All right, but we're gonna go ahead and go because it is late and they're probably gonna get in trouble by their parents. If not, they're probably gonna get grounded or something, um, and whatnot. So they're all gonna head on home. Um, we're gonna ask her to become girlfriend later, um, because she hates us. She hates our guts. Um, and she's hungry, but we might and actually invite over, um, I should've just did travel instead of being extra, but we might just invite over, uh, Mike because, um, he has not met his daughter yet. Uh, so, yeah. Alright, so, um, I don't know what the heck Lucas is wearing. I mean, he is an actor, he just came back from work and all, but, like, really? Really? Um, so, I think what she's gonna do is probably, like, ground everyone. Oh, and we forgot to introduce you guys our butler. So this is our butler, our recently- I kinda hate that our butlers are, like, old and, like, stuff, cause, like, that means they're gonna die soon! <laughs> oh my gosh, but that's our butler. Um, I don't know if we have- we have a maid, but she doesn't come until for a while, so I don't know. Um, and then the butler's room is, like, downstairs in this room. I had to make some sort of, like, room, but, like, I didn't want the outside of the house to look goofy and funny and stuff like that, so, um, yeah. The butler's down here. Um, the downstairs is always a lot less laggy because there's not a lot of stuff down here. Um, but we have a little living room. Uh, Daniela's room is down here as well. The butler's room right next to it. Um, we're gonna also put on auto lights, all lights, and baby primrose, primrose is down here as well. I kind of hate that primrose is downstairs by herself, basically. But like, I mean, she could stay with Asher. But, like, Danielle is not going to travel all the way up to Asher's room to take care of Primrose. Um, so yeah, so when Primrose ages up, my plan is to go ahead and move Primrose in here with Asher. Um, because she'll be a toddler then. And, um, she, she's not 
It's not going to take her long, so yeah, she ages up next Wednesday, even though she was basically born on New Year's Eve. But hey, it is what it is. So she's going to bunk with Asher up here, their space, and I don't know why it keeps disappearing for the life of me. Stop doing that. Oh my gosh, like, it won't even, like, register that it's there, okay? It's not even, like, registering that it, maybe because there's so much stuff going on, but, like, what do you expect? What do you expect? And then what's this? Oh. Okay, I guess we can put that downstairs in her room. She literally has no room for nothing. Um, she even has her, like, cheerleader map, which I'm, like, not even sure where to put that, to be honest. But, like, she has no room for squat. Um, like, I don't want to, like, all of these hold special memories, okay? So, excuse me for being a little sentimental. But here's that. I mean, I mean, it's cute. It's giving. Um, so that's that. Please, please. Do not get rid of the setup, because if you get rid of the setup, I'm gonna hurt you. Um, so I think what, um, Kylie's gonna do is kind of, like, be a parent, I guess, and be like, no, why the heck were y'all out this late? And they kind of have to explain that, hey, we were out doing this. Okay. Um, we're gonna discipline, we're gonna do firm, because, like, I mean, she's disappointed, but, like, I guess she kind of understands why they're late. Because they did go to, like, prom or whatever. And she's like... Because their curfew is 9 o'clock. I feel like they're... Okay. I feel like for, like, the older teenagers, they should be home before 10. Or on 10. And it's like... It's like, they should be back, you know? But, like, I feel like for the younger teenagers, like, River and Asher, they should be back before 9, you know, p.m. Like, there should be no reason why they're out that late. I also don't know where she went. Oh, she went back here to go exercise for some weird reason. But she's going to also get that discipline as well. Especially since, you know, I feel like she's going to be a little bit harder on Daniela. Specifically because Daniela is... She should know not to come out this late, you know? Like, I feel like she's still going to be firm with her, but, like, she does, in fact, have a daughter of her home, of her own to take care of, and it's important that um, Daniela be there for Prim's life and just be there to take care of her if need be. So she is going to get the disappointment treatment just as much as everybody else. She's not going to be singled out, so to speak, but, like... She's like, look, mom, I got a crown. And she's like, yeah, um, sure. Okay. <laughs> oh, like, we can't, oh. Oh, we can't even change it during curfew hours. So it's like, it is what it is. But we're going to go ahead and get some leftovers um, because why not? Same with her. They're pretty much all going to get some leftovers. And they might as well just stay awake at this point because, like, um, yeah. And then here's, like, her birth certificate or Primrose's birth certificate. So she's gonna quickly eat, um, and then go to sleep. Um, good thing Prim is asleep already, but we're gonna quickly go ahead and go to sleep. Um, there's so much stuff going on on Social Bunny as of right now. Um, I honestly- okay, wait. Oh my gosh. It's always so nice to see you, Daniela. You never fail to put a smile on my face. Uh, sure, great. Um, a pillow smacked me, smacked to my soul. It will take days to crawl out of this hole of sadness. I, okay, the pillow fight was so euphoric. I feel like I'm glowing. Great job for you, Darwin. Okay, same thing. And I just kind of just, I don't even look at these at this point. Like, it's like, um, yeah, I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna be that, like, majority. And then we're gonna be like... A what? I honestly have no idea what be going on at this point. Um, we're just gonna... Same thing? And we can... It's funny, because we can like our own posts, and it's like... Oh, wow. We have nothing else better to do? Okay. Um, and then... You look like a shaved llama. 
Okay. You look like a shape pillow. <laughs> okay. All right. So that's that. Um, so she's going to quickly do that. Go to sleep. You know, I'm really hating the snow as of right now, but it is spring. Uh, the first day of spring. So yes. Uh, we don't have to deal, deal with that for too long. Um, he might actually... <sighs> so you consider this dinner. This is dinner to you. Wow. I kind of feel bad because Lucas did recently fell out of the range of being popular, I guess. Um, can we like, no? Okay, bye. <laughs> She's like, oh, bye. Um, but they actually do have a bit, okay, so there is a little bit of backstory with them. They do kind of have like a strained relationship, so they do need to talk about their fears about relationship and being cheated on like they have never cheated on each other but like they are kind of afraid of that and like considering that they're not able to spend as much time with each other they haven't been able to uh recently you know spend time with each other they haven't been on a date in a while um okay this outfit i cannot take you seriously with this outfit <laughs> Change your outfit, bro. Like, I cannot take you seriously at all. But he's gonna use the bathroom. But I feel like they have a bit of a restrained relationship, especially since he works a lot. So does she. They really focus on their careers, especially now that they have a lot of kids and stuff like that. I mean, they don't really need to work, considering all the money that they have. But, like, uh, he's, he's literally going through it because he did fell out of the range of the fame. So, like, he literally has to start all over kind of all over um from you know being i think he was at level two or i think three i don't know but like he he's just been working a lot recently and haven't hasn't really been there and new year's was awful <laughs> for some people it was awful and then asher is just breaking it down so here we have asher i forgot to introduce you guys quickly asher um, he, he is the cutie of the bunch, I guess. He's lactose intolerant, he's a loner, and he is a music lover just like his mom. But instead of, like, singing and stuff, he wants to create music, so he is trying to work on becoming a the, okay? Okay, so many things are going on, and it's distracting me. I'm not sure what I want to be when I grow up, and all my friends seem to have it all figured out. How do I figure it out myself? Honestly, me. No worries, you've got time. Sure, yeah. His responsibility is all over the place. Anyway, so he is trying to become a violinist. So he is going to actually practice because he, yeah, he, he wants to be, he wants to pursue in like being a violin. But honestly, I love their rooms. I feel like each of their rooms really describes who they are, especially like Darwin's room, which I don't know. It doesn't even show like, even if you hover over it, but this is his science project that he did and it's like like I feel like their rooms definitely show uh, bro I'm telling you my sims are so crazy why are you out here bro okay we're gonna end it off right here because he's concerning me and like he looks like a smurf slash avatar anyway thank you guys so much for watching I hope you guys enjoyed this current household They're, like Oh my gosh, there's so much going on in this household, I can't even. Anyway, as always, I hope you guys make sure you like, subscribe if you haven't already, and leave in the comment section box below what was your favorite part of today's video, the randomness of it all, or prom, or being disciplined, or whatever it may be, and I hope to see you guys in the next one. Bye, my donuts!